everybody, welcome back to Search and Power Gaming. When we last left off, we uh, we went back and uh, pretty much tidied up a lot of the stuff. Well, no, we finished up um, the Milkman Conspiracy, and I never wanted to go back there again. We were able to finally progress up to this area, and we returned Kiddo's brains. Now... I know this isn't where I left us, however, in the off time, I actually went back and found everything in those areas. So now I'm ready to see what the rest of this game has in store for me. Found all of the uh, collectibles so far. So whoever you are, Let's go into your brain and see about helping you out. Oh, if you don't like the performance, a simple boo will do. I don't know who you are, but I'm going to help you out. The worst thing, obviously the, uh... Oh, what was it? Um, Cut! the milk player is pretty bad. Hey, kid, can't you see I'm trying to produce a play here? Uh, no. Oh, God. Even a child can see I've lost control of this production. Okay, Becky. Get a grip. Child? Look, kid. It wasn't always like this. We used to have a hit show on our hands. Everybody loved us. But then our big star, Bonita Soleil, got stage fright and locked herself in her dressing room. Oh. So now we're stuck flipping between sunshine shenanigans and the horror of Hagatha Home. Uh -oh. Which is like flipping between a root canal and a sharp stick in the eye. Just ignore Jasper. He's just a critic who happens to be right. I'll go talk to Benita. I'm sure all she needs is a little pep talk. That and acting lessons. You can get Benita to take the stage again. Then you're the star of my show, kid. Okay, cool. Yeah, so the worst part, other than going back into the Milkman conspiracy, was the fact that, uh... Well, oh, these are terrible. Oh, I hate that. Um, was the fact that I had to go back and do the race with Mila. Oh my god, that was so annoying. <laughs> It took me like 20 minutes of just like walking around the area. And of course they have that timer there. So that you can be like, oh yeah, I'm going super fast. But it's like, no, I need to take my time and Got figure it. out everything. Not, you know, where... Like where where the hell are all those things kind of Got thing, it. you know? Suitcase tag. That's what I need here. But yeah, that that was pretty rough. Um, since I found like pretty much none of them. Got it. At least a very limited amount of them. Hey! Guess she really doesn't want to see anyone right now. Okay, so that's where she is. Hey! Guess she really doesn't want to see anyone right now. I think I need to use my invisibility. But I also kind of want to get the rest of these. So, it was terrible. Yep. Uh, Sashin was easy. Um, I actually was able to go back and do Coach Oleanders, which I was very surprised about. What in the world is this? Looks like it needs a candle to work. Candle. All right, whatever. Whatever you need. So far, so good on collecting stuff, which I am a okay with. You know, at some point, I'm gonna figure Got out, it. you know, which buttons do which. <laughs> at some point. Maybe not now. Ooh, ammo up. One of these days. 
Is there a level above that I need to get stuff? I don't know. Who knows? Yep. Oh, stand up there. Okay, thank you. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything above me. However, I do need to actually... Get these. Dang it. Okay. Got it. Okay. Glad that that did absolutely nothing. Perfect. You love to see it. Okay, I think. Oh, damn it! <laughs> right as I say that, purple fucker. <laughs> All right, where are you? You get down from those rafters, you hear. I need you for collectible. Any date? There you are. There we are. Okay, cool. So I think that pretty much does this area. Oh, but there's a lot of them. Oh, there's a suitcase in here. Not exactly what I wanted to do. Maybe I should come back later when he's not sleeping. He looks too mean to wake up. Okay. If you say so. I mean, I was just gonna beat the shit out of him. I think actually he is the boss of this area. If I'm not mistaken. I remember not a whole lot. But I do believe that I have seen at least his boss fight. And a lot of people calling shenanigans on it. <laughs> so yeah. She can't see me. Kid, can't you see I'm trying to have a moment here? <laughs> Sorry, I was looking for Bonita Soleil. You mean the personal muse of Gloria Von Guten, her inner sunshine? The spirit of her youth, yes. That's me. What do you want, an autograph? I'm kind of busy here. <laughs> so who's that crying? Oh, sorry. Yeah. Hey, can we kill the waterworks for a second? Thanks. It's a recording. It helps me focus. Oh, okay. They need you on stage right away for your big number. Am I not playing this right or something? I'm drowning in a quagmire of self-pity. Why aren't you getting that? Should I be doing more with my hands? So, you're not going out on stage? Have you seen any of the plays we put on here? Those god-awful slices of Gloria's terrible life? How am I supposed to bring light to those? Listen, the burden of being the only sunshine in this theater is just too much for one beautiful, glowing, inspirational muse to bear, you know? Is there any way huh. I can get you to take the stage? For the fans? If you can get me some help out there so I'm not the only light on the set. I'll turn on a spotlight. Uh, that could work. But you'll need a candle. Uh, I think there might be a spare in the storeroom. If you can get a candle into a spotlight and light it, I'll come out and give the show one last try. But I'm not promising anything. Okay. So, are you... Did you put a candle in that... No. No. But I'm about... Thanks, Sonny. <laughs> I'll leave you okay. alone. Thank you. Now, where was I? 
<laughs> okay. Uh, half, a lot, and not one. Okay. So then in here, we'll probably have the rest of these, maybe? Oh. That's, ugh, I thought I had the wrong, the other one. Let's see your issues. Hagatha Home for Girls. Hmm. Yeah, what a mean, what a mean old lady. I always hate that, you know? You always hear stories of, like, what is it, um... Like, boarding schools and... Uh, what else? Like, any of these, like, very stressful, like, camp situations, and they're just, like, terrible on, on the people, on the kids, at least. Got it. It. Nice. Should I really be collecting these? Yes. Oh, okay, so it's just a giant circle. So I just need to go up. Alright, cool, cool. Never mind. I want to stay down here, apparently. Apologize if you heard that. If not, then we will continue like normal. And if you're wondering what, what that was, eh, my dog's barking. That's about it. <laughs> Got the candle. And then just follow this down. And voila. Okay. Ooh, but now I can go out there and get this one. Yes, it's all coming together now. Birds of a feather now. I'm pretty sure I was supposed to like talk to her before I just like jumped in her mind, but who knows. That's not the kind of backstory I want. Boom! Oh, scene change. Look alive, people! Bonita Soleil is about to take the stage. Flower girls in position one. And action! Tonight, I will be playing the part of Gloria Von Guten, the famous actress! In this nostalgic memory of her breakthrough role in the smash hit musical... Sunshine Shenanigans! <laughs> and where would Gloria be without her muse? Her inner sunshine! The spirit of her youth! Play tonight, once again, by Lolita Soleil! Oh, I do so hope that my mother is proud of me! Not again! <gasps> the Phantom! I've seen some bad plays in my day, but this one's an actual menace! And it's all her fault. It's her bad acting that makes the Phantom strike. <laughs> this time, I'm going to file a formal complaint and get this theater shut down. Great. Well, I'm off to go kill myself. You know, you could be a more <laughs> constructive critic. Kid, if you want to see a good play, come talk to me. I've got a script here that'll knock him dead, I promise. 
Hey! Maybe that's not what I want. Whoa, 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 whoa! Careful! That's the manual mood override. That's how we set the right mood for the play. Mess with that, and we'll have happy plays on sad sets, sad plays on happy sets, total chaos, or worse, improv. So whatever you do, don't mess with the manual mood override unless you want to see some strange stuff happen. I think Becky's not telling me the whole story. I should go no. give her a piece of my mind. What's this? Oh, it changes the set. response there no, is no. Are you guys going to fight me? Good boy. Ruff, ruff. Okay. Okay, that seems like something... Want to. I actually want to see about the play. Let's go back. What did I miss back here? sweet smell in the air. Let us spin and be happy, entwined in this pole of love, forever young and twisty. Rejoice, for spring has beset in upon ourselves, and the spirit of May is a lingering. Hooray! Hooray! May May Okay. Excuse me. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, this is the stuff that I wanted. Yes, good, good. I knew there was going to be some stuff over here. Okay. Actually, is there something way up there? Here. No, it doesn't look like it. Does look that's everything. So let's go talk to Becky. Are you Becky? Hey, you said that if Benita performed, everything would be okay. Okay, so I left out the part about the deadly phantom. I thought you'd chicken out. Ma'am, I'm a psychonaut. Just show me how to get up to those catwalks he hides out in and sorry, no way up there. Well, there was this one play. We would lo 
lower this prop hot air balloon down from the catwalk and then pull it back up again. If you find okay. it or any other flavor, crying out loud, just bring it to me and I'll run the actors through it. We're so desperate for new material around here. Oh, so then do I have to get this play from you, my man? Hey, can you help me get up to the catwalk so I can fight that phantom? Ah! Can't get there from here! <laughs> I mean, unless you did that one particular play on that one particular set. Oh, but what am I saying? That's almost impossible! Forget about it! The theater is doomed! Hey, why do you have to nice. be so hard on Benita? I'm trying to save you from that mysterious phantom character. He only attacks when Bonita performs. If we got rid of Little Miss Sunshine, we'd all be safer now, wouldn't we? I'm only thinking of the children. Sure. Benita's just trying to lighten things up around here. Ah! I've seen better shines on a shoe! She should quit now while she can still get a job as a nightlight. If you can't say something nice, don't say anything at all. The young boy's protests, though heartfelt, quickly lapsed into simplistic and tedious platitudes. One and a half stars. If you hate the show so much, why don't you just leave? Oh, I can't stop looking at it. It's like the sight of a horrible car accident. A car accident where the victims can't act and the paramedics forget their lines. All right, later, you old gas bag. Listen, this play just stinks. Here, try this one instead. This play has some action in it, some zing. Wow, thanks. Are you actually being nice? No, I'm just trying to keep myself halfway entertained. Go, give that to Becky, and see if she can't find some actors to ruin it. Okay. But I'll hold on to that, is what I really want to do now. Let's see about getting up to the top there in the next cycle. I need to get up there. But how? Oh, sorry. Ow! <laughs> hey, careful there. Somebody could get hurt. <laughs> How do I get up there? Oh, I'm so tantalizingly close. you got, girl? What's up? You're not scared of that phantom, are you? No, it's not him I'm frightened of. It's that fat one who clings to the side of the theater like a blood-swollen tick sucking out its life. Ew. He's always been there, but he wasn't always that big and loud. I couldn't hear him much at all, really, until Gloria's mother hit the stage. He didn't like her performance either? No, I mean hit the stage, curse splat, jump from the catwalks while Gloria was in Paris. Ew. Yeah, that's what the janitor said, too. Oh. Now you see, that performance is exactly what we need to practice. Beta kid, I'm through. As long as Jasper and that phantom are out there, I'm staying back here, wallowing in my glamorous torment. The show must... Yeah, it must go on without me. As long as Jasper rolls... Sorry, kid. I'll leave okay. you alone. So she's not coming out anymore, which means I need to figure out this with my own brain. That's fair. Okay, so 
The only thing I could think of would be to change the mood. Start doing shad stories. See what this gives us. Oh. never come, but I think I see the mail train approaching through yon tunnel. Mail train? Yay! Surely it bears to me a letter from my dear mother who abandoned me at this school for girls so long ago. A dragon? Ah! Ha ha ha! Tis a dragon indeed. You have been fooled and burned. Well, that just uh, oh god, now they're enemies. Okay. Oh gosh, you guys are little terrorists. Ow! Ow! It's so hot! Wow, I am hating this! Wow! Ow! 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 You guys were fine. So I can't do anything with that. Can I? Yon dragon is a mystical force of the theater. Only theater itself can affect it. Duh. Ha ha ha. Okay. So then I guess I go back. Oh good, more enemies. Ha ha! Welcome to Haggath, the home school for girls, where you will begin your long and painful training in the theatrical disciplines. Wa ha ha! But I don't want to study theater! I want my mom to come take me home right now! Your mom has a career and a boyfriend to think about. She doesn't have time for an ugly little girl like you. <laughs> there is nothing more tedious than the tears of an unlovable child. It's time to suffer for your art. Hmm. Ow! Thank you. Okay, so it seems like that's all the enemies. <laughs> I feel like the levitation was a mistake. But it's fine. air balloon I need to get to the catwalks. Now, if I could just get them to do a play that brings it down here, I could ride it up to the catwalks and take care of that phantom. You're not wrong. But how do I get them... Okay.
I've got 97, and I've got two more of those bags. All right. Hey, what's this? A new script? Night of Joy. Weird. It smells like popcorn, and it doesn't say which set to play it on. Oh, well, we'll just play it on whatever's on stage. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? <sighs> Here, you can be my first AD. Use the megaphone if you want to run the play again. Okay, new script, everybody. Let's practice. And action. was brave in thought and deed. Can't you hear his mighty steed? Yeah, just ride on by, Sir Deadbeat Dad. Don't hang around to help raise your poor daughter. Jerk. Ah, no, wait. Wait, we can talk this through. Uh, okay. I think that's about all the time I have for this one. So if you guys could just like leave me alone, if I could like, all right, save it, <laughs> and then we can figure this out in the next one. Alrighty. So yeah, we're we're good here. We'll try and figure out this whole play nonsense, and then we'll uh, hopefully be able to finish up Gloria and her anger issues or mood swings or whatever they are. So until then, see ya.